I feel right. like I feel like that's a Jersey person. I might be wrong. Don't yell at me, Luminous, if you're not from Jersey. <laughs> <laughs> Good games to Luminous, but now it's time for it's time for Grand Finals. Um, and oh wait, so is this a Philly sauce? Yeah, this is a Philly sauce. Oh wait, he plays Rob now? He's shown the Roy, the Rob, and the Mario all today. Yeah, I know he, I know he plays Mario and Roy. Like when I saw the tag sauce, I was like, this can't be the other sauce from Philly because I don't think he plays Rob, but oh. Yeah, and I saw I saw Beast come into chat earlier and he was like, yo, it's a... Uh, like, sauce entered, and he was surprised. So I assume this is the Philly sauce. Oh, yeah, okay, yeah. Yeah, it has to be, because this is because he plays Roy, so... I recognize the Roy color, yeah, that's definitely Philly sauce. Yeah, this is, this is definitely uh, a matchup that I think is in Roy's favor. Uh, okay. he, he's, yeah, he's very... He's a fast character. He can't contest ZSS's speed. He could be all over DFS in a way where a lot of characters can't. Um... And, like, the dish strength and his damage output, like, you know. Yeah, it's a, it's one of those, it's, it's a matchup where I feel like ZSS can do it. Like, it's not impossible for her. Oh, yeah. But just, but just by having, like, having your weaknesses be few and far between, weaknesses that ZSS can exploit effectively be few and far between, especially on a wide stage like PS2, like, you're just... You're going air to air with her, but you have a sword and better damage and, and more consistent kill tools. Right? It's just, yeah. It all I, it all starts to fall apart once CSS falls behind a little bit. Yeah, I wouldn't even say that. Um, Roy maybe has more consistent kill tools. I just think in the matchup, like in the matchup specifically, you know, character to character, um, Roy could definitely get away. With his confirmed a lot easier than DSS can try to condition Roy into like say like I don't know. Nair flip click he has better out of shield options and unless you roll in like that and you might die. Good DI over here for it. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Probably the best DI to this DFS part of it. Patient play off of the ledge is what you have to do. Uh, ZSS puts you in such a dichotomy where like you want to like you both need to ledge trap her. But you also don't want to be too aggressive in the corner, because for risk of losing or like failing in the corner. Yeah. Okay. Even game across the board now. Yeah. I, I, every time I see a Roy or Tom dash back like that, I already know it's like a missed like um, glide forward tope, and it's still funny to me. Because the move is still strong, but it's like man. It's just not just, safe. Yeah, just fortunate. Though. Let, let it work. Um, but but WebGP has like really turned it around. Um, because uh, I feel like, like you know, the first dock sauce took that in like five seconds, and now he's making it harder for sauce to land. It's it's like a little bit of adaptation to counter adaptation. Like Web came into the match starting to looking to try and catch jumps, and that's what he was doing right, and that's what he's doing right now. Sauce immediately showed him he couldn't. So Webb mixed up his game plan. Now we see Sauce mixing up his own, and that's what's getting him this near game win off of that hard single read. Yeah, one thing that WebJP needs to needs to watch, especially against Roy, is that when he goes for some of these hard read upbeats or hard read, you know, hard read, um, even kick flips sometimes, Roy can punish you really hard. Like, so if you whip something like that, you will die like an imaginary person. So, it, don't, it don't matter. Yeah. Like, something like that. See, like, that down tilt is, like, negative on hit. And Roy is up here, so it's, like, frame seven, I believe. So. Is it really that fast? I think you're right. Um, it's like frame seven. Frame seven with armor. That's great. Yikes. That hitbox is beautiful. <laughs> oh, you died now. Yeah. Oh, wow. Yeah, you died. That was good stuff by um, JP. Um, that's something that he started to do um, mid stock, mid like second stock. Um, because he was letting he was letting Sauce run in on him free, and he was just like, okay, well, what do I do? Roy is Roy is a nuisance. I'm gonna start throwing up more side beans airs, right? Now that is some counterplay you could do. Um, especially like you know, it's harder in like certain circumstances, it's harder. Stop your dash sometimes, right? Um, and that's something you could do to like try to keep Roy's at bay. That side B, especially that side B late percents. Um, pretty, pretty good move. Good stuff by WebJP. 
the, the movement that it grants it, movement with any character is just like, ex exceptional but with dss having multiple tools for her to just get around all across the stage it's really hard to keep her down that's why having a disjoint like roy's is so important it's, it's up to it's up to sauce to make it make it worth his while because web has done a amazing job at cho basically choosing when he wants to get hit mm -hmm. he w definitely whether that's gone but we're gonna go back to ps2 um you know i agree no, nothing too crazy um i feel like in this matchup like um fb is a stage that i feel like is annoying for both characters like neither character really wants to go to fb so i feel like we're gonna see um an all platform set and and i can't see sauce going mario or or rob against um css it wouldn't make no sense so. Yeah, why why trade out a matchup that you know for sure is winning? You can just play a little bit better, play a little bit stronger, which he's been shown to do. Like given his reverse 3-0 against Lemon T, uh, and I think it was reverse 3-0 against Luminous too. Yeah. <laughs> just just enough. Yeah. Oh yeah, I read that right away. That's something I've I've seen Web go for that a couple times. Like um, just the read of the roll with for uh, up the punish. He's really on top of tech options, and even when he, even when he knows that, even when he doesn't have a read, like a hard read, and he knows that, he'll go for the one that that ensures he gets a kill, or that ensures like he stays safe. Like he's really on on point with a lot of his tech situations, yeah. offensively. Yeah, and talking about on point, that um anti air up tilt by um Sauce is um gonna take that second stop. I need to take that first off, excuse me. Oh man, yo, Z ZSS low profiling makes me so upset, man. Like this, it's like ZSS, ZSS hurt box, it like in general, just like, it was, the, it was it was designed by an intern, man. I blame the intern for everything, I don't care. Oh, Roja hitting those. Man. Oh, he gets yeah. out with a rising board. That was so aggressive. Like, it's good. Yeah. Assuming forward air 1, 2 both connect, but... Yeah, and break the eye coming up from Sauce. Thankfully, somebody... And keep, Sauce keeping his jump. Let's say Web... I was like, Web definitely turned the situation around, but, um... Oh, he he doesn't have... He, oh, he did have his foot kick. He held on to oh. that. Oh, okay. I, yeah, I thought he used it, but... Just ping-ponging back and forth from one wedge to the other. <laughs> yeah, and he got up smashed. Yeah, you know, I was actually surprised that, um... We didn't see an up beat come out from Toss from and, and on any of those, uh... Any of those hits on the shield. Um... Cause he got a bunch of wet noodle aerials. Oh, no, oh, no. Oh, no. Okay, get out of there. Did he die? Wow, he super died. That... Okay, got... Oh, man. I feel like that guy was terrible. Like, I don't know if... See, cause like I'm not really um, sure on um, like the ZSS up air routes, right? But like, I feel like he was going straight up. I don't know. Yeah, he's. I don't know. Can we see the? We can see the radar. Yeah. Assuming I'm... this flash doesn't blind us all. I don't know. I mean, like that was good stuff by WebJP. Um, he did. He did send horizontal. Like he's going. No, He's I'm going to corner DI. Mm -hmm. I was talking about after like the first up air, right? But once you got, like, I feel like once you got hit by the first up air and you went straight up, I'm just like, oh, what the hell? <laughs> he kind of just. Oh, he, okay, yeah, yeah, sorry. I was, like, I was thinking about the boost kick. No, no, no. Yeah, you're, you're right. You're right. Oh, yeah, you know, once you got to that point, that's me. Okay, you just want the conflict out. Like, there you go. No. <laughs> it's like, all right, you got it, dude. Yeah. You got those? Okay, you got those. Yeah, you got it. Uh, we're gonna buy PS2, and um, yeah, um, what JP has been weather has has been weathering this storm at every single turn, where it looks like Sauce is about to pull away, and what JP either has like great survivability on his stocks, or just happens to take his stock first for some strange reason. Another, he was looking for another one of those like hard neutral check reads, which is like 
that kills, and that's great. But it seems like Web has Web has found the solution for that one. So Web, Web JP has been checking all of all of Sauce's dashes, and that's something that he like he wasn't doing in like the beginning of game one. Um, now it's like every single time like you see Sauce sh like dashing towards him, he's checking with the forward tilt, checking them with the air, checking them with the with the neutral air, right? And even then, he used his forward tilt and put him in a your situation. All, that's it's really all she needs her forward tilt to be because she has phenomenal tools that are basically ground moves even if they're not really like Zara is basically a ground move and despite it, you doing it midair so all she really needs forward tilt to be is a fast quick poke and yeah that's all that's all she wrote but we can't sweep on Roy's explosiveness. Oh, yeah. I'm surprised. No. Okay. Yeah, he just went for that. I don't think Webzipi thought he was going to go all the way out there and he's trying to double jump like that. Love it. Yeesh. Um, I was just about to say, I, I, I haven't seen Sauce go for any j um, jab these. The jab side these. I've... And um, you could definitely do it against ZSS at like this percent right now. So now is it only at a sweet spot jab or any jab? Um, yeah, no, it has to be sweet jab. If, if you get um the what middle jab, it's not gonna be like right. So um, either way, um, Sauce definitely is in control of this game. After that stock he took, uh, I think that kind of rattled Red JP a little bit because like. Yeah, it's like whenever whenever you go off like that against ZSS and like it's like an, a lot of characters like that, especially out of work. Yeah, ZSS is one of those characters that like she never expects to be edge guarded. She's always the one like like going out there against her. You expect almost to be reversed in some instances, but that's the power power of the, the fast character with a prominent disjoint. Mm -hmm. You can just you can get there before they have even time to react, and you can be on their doorstep oh my in a blink. Of an hour. Yo, okay, man. Roy's jab does your taxes, walks your dog, um, makes you dinner. Sometimes, sometimes it's a little soggy because you know the noodles can be a little soggy, but you know that is wild. And this is and that and that's why, right? WebJP just tried to line in him with the aerial, and Sauce so said. I'm pressing A. <laughs> and got got weak hit up air to strong up air and killed him. Which is true, by the way. That is true. See, like, right there. Like, even though he took that stock, you, you could have tried to jab side beat him at that percent. It could, be, it could be a matter of conditioning. He's trying to make WebJP think that he's going to play... More reserved on hit, but play really in his face. Yeah. Which can, you know, a conditioning like that can start making players hold out. And yeah. Catch him with the catch. Catch wrong di against Roy. Jeez. <laughs> yeah, you explode. That's a very good point too. Yeah, you could be you could be conditioning to hit, to see where where he's gonna di in those situations. Like, can he get away with a cheesy kill at 40 because he was diing away on a jab side that never can. <laughs> so, uh, we'll see how this starts, but you know, they're starting off this game for an even faster. I like that punch from my JP. Even it's simple. I feel like he's been going a lot, going for a lot of those um, upbeats out of shield, and like I said, early percent upbeat out of shield like that, that might, may or may not hit. Um, you'll die for that game for it. I thought he was going to go for that, like, dare at ledge thing where like sour spot dare confirms into back air mm -hmm. and if sweet spot then it spikes but now he's just the classic jab at ledge yeah yeah, yeah you got the classic jab up there oh my god yeah he got wet middle fair into grab which is true <laughs> uh it's so funny um because one of the tough things to do um as Roy online is to react to like what hit what type of hits that you get um and uh, it's, it's funny, like, seeing, like, a, the wet noodle confirm for But, um, good stuff like WebJP kind of evening it up. Man, 
he's really... I mean, Webb has brought back, brought these games back before, right? Like, we saw it in game one. But... Sauce seems to be, like, pulling out all the stops today. Or something in this game. Like, he was... He's not letting Webb and uh, Tech roll in anymore. He punished that really hard. Like, he's getting a lot more of the Sweet Spot Jack confirms. Even if they're just for for damage and not for stocks, uh, it's keeping Webb off balance and forcing him to use resources that he doesn't necessarily want to at, at specific intervals. Yeah. And um, one thing I'm seeing that Sauce is doing, um, because WebJP has been checking his dashes really hard. So now you see Sauce actually shielding a lot more. Um, shielding a lot more and waiting when he has WebJP in the corner. Trying to cover cover everything there. And the hold down. That was so smart. Yeah, he caught a jump, man. Okay. Um and Fuss was up by a lot. Mm -hmm. Yeah, and what JP brought it back. Is he out of the percent window for that? What? Uh he went for a jab up there and just it just completely whiffed. Oh, uh, I just think he that's what it looked like. It looked like he just didn't get the momentum and jump forward. He missed his dash. Okay, that makes sense. Yeah. Didn't miss that one. Let's try again. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> no, um, no, no third one. Yeah, um, actually against um, characters like ZSS and Fox, when you go for a down throw at zero, um, you actually can't get like an air. Um, you have to go for like down throw jab or like down throw like up throw or something. Because of like their fastball. I mean, because they're, they're fastballs. It's like really, really weird. That makes sense though. Like it's like they just hit the ground too soon, so you have to go for. Oh, he caught him jumping. Yeah. And that's the reset. Yeah, and you know what happened? I think as I was praising. Sauce for his shielding and playing a little bit um, shield campy, he just stopped. And WebJP was just like, word, okay. Well, <laughs> business as usual. <laughs> like, thanks, man. I'm having yeah. some trouble with that. <laughs> yeah. like, look how much shield he's using. And then, you know, Web was just like, all right. Yeah, like ZSS grabbing you. She doesn't get anything off of it. Down throw, up, like up throw kills. Forward throw puts you in a tech chase situation, but it's nothing guaranteed. And back throw is for exclusively cheese. Uh, by that I mean back throw uh, flip kick, which is mm -hmm. not real at all. <laughs> yeah, but yeah, it's not real. That's the match I confirm. That that confirm is definitely just all on your head. Oh yeah. <laughs> like, if, <laughs> if someone cites that as like, oh she's so good, back throw flip kick, it's like, bro, are you, are you sure about that? Definitely, definitely some um, Nightmare on Elm Street. Nightmare on Elm Street stuff, you know. Like. Yeah, but shielding against ZSS basically grants, Z grants her, if she grabs at all, it gives her 11 guaranteed. That's it? Yeah, um, but it, uh, you know, it also... Um, some things that ZSS could do, especially against a, uh, another fast forward like Roy, uh, you get grabbed. And the thing is, she can put you in a tech chase, tech chase situation off of the throw. Um, so you can maybe get like a, I don't know, like a down smash, any type of read that you want, any type of imaginary read that you want, or you can throw them off stage, right? It's kind of like the Fox theory. Um, Fox doesn't get anything off grabbing, but he gets stage position, and stage position against the Fox is really annoying. <laughs> so. Oh yeah, like it's, it's definitely worthwhile to keep going for those grabs, be like because tech situations are so powerful with a character that's so fast mm -hmm. but i would always rather be grabbed and forced to forced into a basically a, what is a coin flip versus like spot dodging and getting my spot dodge red with nair and die like there's like there's a definitely a risk reward here that is so much more in favor of just like running forward with the shield especially with a character with good out of shield options that roy is relatively good out of shield options mm. like it's not you're not playing game and watch but you know uppy is still good nair is still good Three, two, 
back to PS2. Yeah, I think oh, you're right. Nope. I think you're right. We're gonna just see. We're gonna see this stage for majority of the of the set. And I'm also like I I also have to wonder like what's being banned, um, because I feel like if I'm sauce, I would. Okay. See, I feel like if I'm sauce. Oh, that I you know that was. Um, <laughs> God bless. Like if I'm sauce, especially now, or maybe you want to change your scenery. Um, because at least just for like. I guess mental stamina. And you just got zero to death. You just had to go like game five. Game four, excuse me. Oh, we caught him holding down. Oh, oh died. no. We died again. Yeah, okay, yeah. I feel like we need a stage switch. I don't know. Maybe it's just me. Yeah, I, I can see that. Web looks really comfortable here. Like, everyone's really comfortable here. But. Oh, man. And even that didn't kill. It's gonna be rough. Mm -hmm. But if you if you close the quarters a little bit, like maybe something like Smashville, to yeah, yeah. Like, and I'm wondering, I don't know what WebJP is um, banning. You know, he could be banning Smashville. He could he be. Probably, sure. He's probably banning Smashville in town. I mean, if, if he's smart. So, uh, oh man, you don't want to take ZSS to Triplats very often. And FD doesn't sound great either. Ugh. <laughs> yeah, this might be just the perfect two stages that has been. <gasps> What? Wait a minute, hold on. We might Bro, be. What the hell just happened? Did you just hit him with. Fair Dare? That. Yeah. Sir? I. Okay, you know, forget. You know, I, you know, forget. As I was talking, Sauce took two stops. You know what? <laughs> yeah, there's a. There's nothing wrong here. <laughs> Can't count him out too soon. He died again. I don't know. I. I I don't know, man. Um, even though he did kind of bring that back. Um, I feel like maybe he still could use for a change of scenery. Um, oh, he got him with the Beerus on that one, too. That was so. That was actually kind of clean. That was weird. That was a weird interaction. So, sometimes sometimes I see, I see weird interactions on um, Wi-Fi, and I wonder sometimes. Like, like what actually, like what actually went through your head? What did you actually press? Versus what actually happened? Either way, I mean, WebJP was on, like, on him. <laughs> like, yeah. Oh, like, yeah. Like, that, that, that viewer reverse laser was kind of wild. Like, I'm willing to give him the benefit of the doubt on some of his movement here, because, like, we saw stock one happen, and that didn't, that didn't look like anything crazy. That was just a like, clean coverage into a con confirmed combo. Uh, ooh, still going PS2. No change of scenery yet, but a, a change in outfit. He's got the gold on. Color counterpicking is real. Right. Yeah, um... Playing this yeah. Safely. Yeah, I mean, yeah, he's already starting off better. Um, World War now. Um, you know... I feel like all those other games that that one were close, like the game might have been an aberration because no one was happy. But, um, yeah, it's been all just two brand points. Wow, he went for that? Why? I. It's such a, such a hefty risk for a game where you've been pretty much dominating the pace the entire time. Like, you don't need. You don't need to rush here. You just need to wait for Sauce to put himself in a bad situation. Sauce, if with all of his amazing plays and incredible confirms, he's been pushing for those. He's been instigating a lot of them. Yeah. And, yeah. and ZSS can thrive off that. Yeah, but also, um, there's like very little risk in that situation. That's fair. Um, that was like confirmed by a. Uh... I would be okay. Yeah, in that situation, it's, it's like very little risk. Like, you know, he whiffed and then went back and got uh, neutral reset. So it's like whatever. <laughs> yeah, I mean, it's just you're playing neutral with the character that has arguably one of, if not the best neutrals in this game. So, like, that's the beginning. Yeah. That's very yeah. nice. All these, all these text options. Yeah. And you see Sauce again, you know, holding shield a lot. Um, 
Yeah, and those jab, those jab anti airs is something I want to, I kind of want to see a little bit more of. Um, especially when you see Sauce kind of like shield camping a little bit, right? Like if you know that WebJP is going to try to do like the bear or something like that, you know, um, you kind of like, like he's doing right there, like try to predict it or try to parry it or something. Oh. Very make, making the best of a bad situation. Right? You can sure to hold inside the stage, and Sauce didn't react quick enough. Still got his hard punish, and he's in a pretty hefty lead right now. That won't kill. Ooh. Jumps away again. Ooh. Yeah, and that's yeah. WebGP has been really good at checking these few dashes and these jumps coming out from Sauce. That was it. Like he like every like every time. Uh, Sauce is within like a three character length. You see WebJP throwing up these airs, throwing up these airs, side beat, he's been clipping them a lot. Oh my god, like, he's not even letting him get away with like landing on aerial and shielding. Like these turnarounds guys have been on point. That could have been it, but just out of the window. Good DI. Yeah. Okay, yeah. Yeah, yeah. Even though that down tilt is safe on shield, um, you can be checked on your next next move. So if you try to do something slick like jab, run up something, you can get checked. It was <laughs> like a four year on a shield by TSS. Yeah. Okay, last stock situation. This is a, this is. I feel like this is like fuck me to get this game. That he's fine. I feel like Sox definitely needs to get this game. Yeah, this would be such a huge momentum swing if he can, but he got caught. Yeah. Yeah, man. And, like, it's like the whole set. WebJP has been, has been calling out a lot of these aerial approaches and dashes coming out from Sauce when it seems like he's kind of, you know, kind of, like, telegraphing it. And that was pretty, I feel like that was pretty good bait by WebJP. Because he threw up that paralyzer from pretty far. I I feel like WebJP didn't fully expect to hit that and just wanted to up smash him. So if that was the case, that was pretty good on WebJP's part. Yeah, I feel like we see that a lot with um, with a lot of Zero Suit stuff. Like since, especially since up smash is like it's so big and can kill, can start combos, it can do it all as long as your opponent is in the air. Ooh. So by pressuring shield and forcing jumps. Like, whether it be with run-up, up smash, I mean, that's how Mars won Janus 7. I, this is, like, a similar a similar idea. Just force the shield, make him jump, catch him yeah. jumping. Yeah, exactly. And you can see that second stock, that's exactly what he did on the second stock also. Yeah. Web might be... I mean, we met, I mentioned it before, and... Oh, wait. Okay, Mario. <laughs> Yo, the counter pick is strong. Oh my god, are we that down bad right now? <laughs> I respect you. I respect you. Oh. Ooh, this is okay. I haven't seen one of these in a while. Oh no, don't die. Okay, he, he almost died. He actually, that was like. He actually awesome. almost died. That was the percent one though, actually. I got 3%. Like that. If you guys don't know your percent windows for Mario Ladder combos, they usually start on 33%. So, uh... Yeah, you can die pretty much at any point, given how your DI works and how the combo they choose. But, mm. like, down throw, up throw, nair, up throw, nair, up air, up air, forward air, like, all that... That usually starts working around 30 to 35%, depending on the character. Yeah, so guys, please. Everybody out there, know your DI. Um, and... Know when you're gonna get sniped for your jump at ledge, um... This stuff by one JP. Yeah. So if there's... Oh, go ahead. Uh, if yeah. there's... Go ahead, go ahead, sorry. Yeah, no, I was gonna say his matchup is like a little different than Roy. Um, you have Mario with the stubby limbs, but... Um, it's a little, it's a little bit harder to put... To get in ZSS's bubble with Mario. Yeah, you're kinda... You're forced to... Get a whole lot closer than you need to with Roy. But... And we make jokes about how, like, oh, Mario on Yoshi's is, like, the ultimate counter pick, because in some ways it is. But this is also one of ZSS's best stages. Like, the walls make her flip-kick shenanigans even that, that much more 
like dramatic and that much more, more flexible. Tri she always does has done very well on triplats with her various combos and extensions. But, like the stage is overall pretty small, so she can dominate a lot of it really quickly. Like this is a really good ZSF stage. Yeah. And um. Yeah, and right now, um, this is still, I mean, Mario in the state, this is still a deficit you could come back from, but like, you know, the way, the kind of way Webby is playing right now, um, this is going to be pretty hard to, this is, this is like a pretty high mountain climb. I think it's just keep on getting higher. Ooh, and that trade, oh, he needed that, that down air. What did that uh, trade with? Yeah, I'll say this. Okay, I was about to say, I'll say this. If he takes the stock, he'll be in the he'll be in the game. Yeah. <laughs> but not what happened. WebGP played it safe, which is pretty smart. Played it safe, just kept throwing out side bees. Yeah, not really much that Mario could do with it at that range, and he was looking to catch jumps once more. But like, as long as he's at that mid range, ZSS can play pretty like. Frustrating to some, safe to others, depending on, like, pick your poison. But she can poke you out until Mario is forced to make a make a reckless pick. And those reckless picks are what he died for twice over. Thrice over, excuse me. Yeah. Um, yeah, I just feel like, um... Yeah, Sosh just kept holding forward. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> and, you know, sometimes, it, you know, it just happens that way. It's like trying to get something started you're down you have to take chances and you know what jp just took advantage of that that's my second wi-fi local win this week you won fusion too oh yeah yeah i mean, I mean he's on a tear if like depending on how much stake you put in uh, uh wi-fi locals but hey man look look he like a win's he, a win yeah, a win's a win, a wife a win's a wife I win, you know we're out here. Um, good stuff to WebJP. Um, yeah, good stuff to WebJP. So, um, congrats.